know, Anderson's has so much to offer, but one of the very best things that we offer to you, our customers, is our gardening calendar. It takes us a lot of time and a lot of effort and really a lot of thought to put this together, but it tells you what to do all year long in your garden and sometimes even in your, in your home. So when we put the calendar together each year, uh, we have a contest and you get to submit photos and we choose 12 of those photos, 13 actually with the cover, uh, to be introduced into our gardening calendar. And the calendar itself has so much information in it. So let me get that pulled out. So not only does it have beautiful photos, but it has information in there about all the events here at Anderson Seed and Garden. Of course, January doesn't have as much fun going on as, as it does in, like, say, oh, July. Uh, and, of course, the pictures are much more colorful in the summer as well, too. But uh, it tells you what's going on at the store, but it also tells you when to fertilize, tells you when to start your seeds indoors, when it's a good time to prune your trees, when it's a good time to plant outside. I mean, it's got all that information, and it also reminds you when when to watch for certain bugs, when to watch for certain diseases, when to watch for different problems in your yard. And we've got all that information built right into our, our calendar to help you be as successful as possible in your garden. This is one of my favorite photos. I love this one. Got that, that beautiful lightning strike that's that's coming out. All the pictures are local, so they're from uh, from Cache Valley and surrounding areas. But uh, you know, our, our gardening calendar has so much to offer, and it's just there to help you be more successful in your garden. And so, you know, for example, here's October. Uh, we've got a couple special events going on. We've got a ladies night should be the 26th of October. Of course, Halloween is in October as well too. But it's also a great time to start your bulbs to force for, for Christmas. So you'd want to do that early, early here in October because that's the time to start your bulbs indoors so that you can force them to have them bloom around Christmas time. So it just depends on, on uh, the, the month and the time of year, but calendar is going to tell you what you need to do to be successful inside and outside with your garden, what problems to watch for, when to fertilize, all that good information you need to be really successful as a gardener. And it's available in our gardening calendar and we still have some left. You're welcome to stop in. We'd be glad to give you a copy of our 2018 Anderson Seed and Garden gardening calendar.